So I'm working with uh, making an augmented reality video call app is how I've been describing it. But what basically what I'm trying to do is get a live video feed of someone and putting it onto my phone with my background. So Sebastian is trying to take um, a 3D image, live image of someone or something, take just the data from the object itself, so remove the background, stitch that data into a single image, single point cloud, so to speak, and then send it through the internet, of course, to his phone, where then he could then see that image. It'll be in two dimensions, Obviously the phone is 2D, but as he moves the phone around, up, down, and around, the image will stay in place, and so you'll get that impression of that 3D data is all there, making it feel more realistic and um, more there, more with you. The excitement I get over this project is beyond what I anticipated because it's not only helping developing holograms and making it easier access, but also improving communications, which is very prevalent in today's world with the worldwide communication, improving that and making it more interpersonal. Projects like these are pretty very ambitious, and so I expect Sebastian and Wheel to get to a finished working product. There's always something more to add, right? We can always add a fourth camera to add, increase the resolution. Uh, we can always send this data to a different device so he's trying to send it to his Android phone, or we could uh, write a client for the iPhone, make it more universal. But yeah, definitely lots of new things that can be done and expanded upon. So Dr. Benz has been one of the most helpful professors I could have asked for. Uh, if I ever have a question, he's there. If uh, he is able to ask me questions that I weren't, I wasn't even thinking of, so that's very helpful. And just being able to talk to him. We have weekly meetings. Uh, that help me understand the program and help him understand the progress I'm making so it's been beneficial in both ways.